Anyone who's ever spent time around a dog knows they will come running if they hear the sound of the treat bag. This happens because they made the connection between the sound of the bag and what happens next, treats. This type of learning is extremely useful for animal training. Trainers even have a specific word for it, a bridge. If you've ever wondered why trainers use clickers or shout good, they are using a bridge to communicate. Why is this necessary for training? Since animals can't talk, they pay so much more attention to your body language and what they are physically doing. Think of it like a blind person with hearing superpowers. When you're training, you need to be able to tell your dog they are doing exactly what you want at that particular moment so that they can learn. They will even remember the smallest differences. I trained Ruby to put her nose on this ball Target. by holding it in front of her nose and bridging her exactly right when she touched it. Target. So she quickly learned exactly Target. what I was asking her to do. Now I can even get her to follow it by bridging her from maintaining Target. contact. Good. Using my target ball, I can direct Ruby exactly Target. where I want her to be at any time. It's pretty neat. Good. I can even use it to teach her other things like spin. All of this was made pretty easy because I was using a bridge. It works on any animal, even cats. Spin. Good. Spin.